Bye. I, <laughs> I love you. I love you too. <laughs> a little excited? Just slightly. <laughs> slightly oh. excited. Good. Austin, my love, my best friend. We have finally reached our wedding day. My heart already bursts with love and adoration of you. I have waited for you and I have stumbled and fallen along the way, but I see God's hand in it all. I see how he uses all things to bring us good. And that good is knowing him more intimately. Dearly beloved, we're gathered here today in the sight of God, these witnesses, to witness the union of this man and this woman in holy matrimony. Uh, the three things that I love most about Brie are her just compassionate heart, how bold she is, and then also uh, just her joyful spirit. What do I love most about Austin? Everything. <laughs> Um, but what I do love most about him is definitely his thoughtfulness. I've never met a man who cares more deeply for people um, to the point where they, he will remember every single detail of a person uh, to remind them that they are seen and loved by God. I also just love how she just has a joyful, fun spirit. Uh, it can kind of get me out of wherever I'm at for a little bit and just enjoy the life that God's given me. Austin is gentle and kind and strong and a safe place for me. Marriage is sacred, but marriage is not savior. Mm. What's happening today is something, but it's not everything. The goal of life is not to make it to this altar. As special as this is, this is not the goal. The goal of life is to know and follow Jesus wherever he leads you. My love, from today on, I will get to call you this forever. You are and will be my love from this moment, from the moment we walk down the aisle as Mr. and Mrs. Stillman. You will be my love and I will be yours. Bria, I do not know what will come our way in marriage but with the Holy Spirit indwelling us, leading me, and with your hand in mine, I can say that it will be a joy. It will be a joy to wake up next to you, to host people in our home, to do ministry together, play video games into the night, <laughs> wrestle our, our golden retriever one day, and if God gives us the gift of children to raise them together. Above all of those things, Brie, I will enjoy you for the rest of our days.
Dad, you will always be my first love and man in my life. But you can rest assured that Austin will confidently step in and carry the weight and responsibility of being the second man in my life. I can't wait to walk down the aisle with you, thinking of the thousands, millions of times you have shown me you love me more times infinity, oodles and gobs, <laughs> and all that jazz. Vested in me by the state of Texas and our Lord Jesus Christ, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Austin, you may kiss your bride. Christ is the source of all redemption in our lives. He is the source of us coming together in marriage today. This day, my love, is a taste of the greater one coming. And while there is overwhelming joy, it pales in comparison to the day death is no more and pain is no more. With that hope in mind, I want to drink all joy of this day in. When I doubt God's love for me, I get to look at you as an Ebenezer of his grace, mercy, and love towards me. I receive you as a gift because you are a gift today and every day to come. My hand in yours, you will never walk alone. I love you with all my heart forever. I will always be 
there to wipe your tears, to laugh at your funny sound effects and voices, and I will always be next to you.